G'day everyone, welcome back to Wayne's Diecast Cars for another uh, Diecast car review. Um, this video we have a Toyota Land Cruiser FJ40 uh, 124 scale from Motomax. This is in a dark green with a white roof. Check out the box here. And the bottom. Quick look at that. Now, let's get this open. We just have a little bit of tape here. And let's try and open them up without draw in the box too much, that way I can pack it back in there, if I need to. So we just got a background, picture background. There's a little bit of tape, just there, we should be right. Yep, there we go. Get rid of all this packaging. Okay, now let's get a little turntable here. Okay, that's on the turntable there now. It's a nice, uh, nice green, nice dark green. So we've got opening doors. And we have opening bonnet. Uh, nothing opens on the back. We've just got the spare wheel. That does look good with the white top. This door opens here too. Give you a look inside in, the, in a minute. So we've got the indicators and park lights on the uh, the guards there. This one here is a little bit crooked. We've got the round grill. So this would be roughly a, a 78 sort of model, 1978. It doesn't have the uh, quarter windows or the uh, rectangle grill. So we've got some detail on the inside, the dash there, Toyota Land Cruiser on the uh, number plate. Give you a closer look. That's the back end there. Close those doors for a minute. We'll have a look underneath. Got some pretty uh, sort of basic details. You can see the leaf springs. Front diff, tails the drive shaft. See bits of the motor, the sump and gearbox and things. We've just got the uh, exhaust in silver, which is a separate piece. Rear diff. The old bar tread on the tyres. Yeah, paint works paint work is good. I don't see any problems there. Got the land cruiser on the side. And 
engine bay, the air filter, put put two bat. Well, that, that's what I'm assuming there is battery, but they only had one in these. And the radiator, the shroud there. You can see see the radiator hose. See the brake booster there, and then over here you had the um, fan for the uh, the heater, and the little vent on the side is where it's got its air in for the for the heating. So bonnet closes well. All the shut lines are good. Door opens up pretty good. Hopefully you can see. Oh yeah, we can't. Yeah, we can see in there. Not too bad. So we've got the glove box here, which then had the um, instructions on it for uh, the four-wheel drive on how to operate that. We can see the two levers. We've got. Uh, yeah, hopefully you can see in there. So we've got the lever. We've got the transfer case lever, and then the gear stick. Then we had the uh, split seat, so single for the uh, driver and then just a one and a half seat for the passenger. We do have the details on the on the door, but being black, you can't necessarily see it. Door closes good. We've got the mirror and it's reflective on the back side here. Nothing on the back end opens. The side mark light there. Door handle is in silver and so is the lock. And then here we can see the uh, speedo and then your other instruments down the bottom Got the steering wheel again we can't see the door details on the inside but this all looks all looks pretty good Got a little bit of fingerprint on it there from my my fingers, but otherwise the paintwork is good. And we've got the black detail around the windows, which be the uh, the window rubbers. So that's not too bad. That looks good. Tail lights and everything they're um, they're good. They're pretty authentic. Got the steel wheels, the hubcaps. They would have been a uh, would have been a split rim. So you can see the Toyota on the front. Headlights could be better. The pegs in the middle are uh, square, which doesn't look that good. But overall, I think that is not too bad. Definitely good for the Land Cruiser lover. So we've got the rear step. And the little uh, bumper bumper guards. The side steps, which is what they all had. Most of the time they were body coloured. Um, but this being the plastic base, that's that'd be why they're plastic. They're um, why they'd be black. Otherwise, they'd normally be uh, body coloured. Front bumper looks pretty original. We've got um, hooks on there, recovery hooks. You can see the end of the exhaust just here. Definitely a good good model um, to have displayed on the uh, shelf for uh, any of those Land Cruiser lovers out there. I do have uh, one of these. 
on my uh, eBay store. So if you would like to go and have a look, then do that. The link will be in the description. And if you want to check out any of my other videos, please watch. I do have uh, another Land Cruiser video there. And plenty of other stuff, which um, you should be happy to, uh, to watch. Alright, thank you. We'll see you all next time.